Hi, this is Lexi. Um, so Lexi is 15 years old and she has, I don't know if you can see it, I won't, if I touch her she'll probably close her mouth, but she's got this kind of friend that's hanging off the side of her tongue there. And it's been growing for her past maybe year or two and she's biting it and it bleeds sometimes. And um, We did a full pre-anesthetic workup. We did chest x-rays, blood work, and abdominal ultrasound just to make sure that she's healthy inside and out. She, everything was totally normal. Um, so I know there's always a concern of putting an older dog under anesthesia, but we, you know, did all the testing. She's fine. We're going to take this bump off today. Um, she's got another one on her foot that we, they just keep that one covered. And we're just going to try to keep her comfy and happy for as long as we can. So we'll update you a little bit more. I already gave her her pre-anesthetic medications to sedate her. They're just going to make her a little bit sleepy, a little bit of preventative pain control before the anesthesia. So. We'll just kind of update as we go, you know, let you know how everything's going with her. Okay, so Lexi's pretty sleepy now. She got her pre-meds, um, so we're getting ready to place yeah. an IV catheter yeah, so we can give her her induction drugs. That one we kind of have to have. So I'm going to shave spot and then place the <clears throat> catheter and tape it in. Lexi's under anesthesia right now. We put her IV in, we gave her some medication in her IV and made her sleepy. And then she has a tube down her trachea that's gonna give her oxygen through the machine and also anesthetic gases to keep her asleep throughout the procedure. Um, and it'll just keep her airway open and she won't have any problems breathing and stuff while she's under anesthesia. Hannah's gonna monitor her throughout the procedure and we'll get her recovered and stuff. So we're just gonna get ready to move her into surgery. Okay, so Lexi's here in the surgery room, the operating room. Um, she's all hooked up to her monitors. We're monitoring heart rate, blood pressure, respiratory rate, oxygenation levels, temperature. Um, Hannah's got to calculate, or not calculate, but she's got to record all of that every five minutes, and she's going to just let me know if anything changes with Lexi. I've got her all, she's all prepped and draped in and everything, and we're ready to go. I do, we're going to do the laser, and she's really just got, I don't know if you want to, Look at the bump. It's right on the edge of her tongue. And so, let me put that ready button on again. So it really isn't going to be much just to kind of take off just a little piece of her actual real tongue there to get this thing off. And we'll use the laser to do that. And that should minimize bleeding quite a bit. And we'll see. We may still have a little bit of bleeding going on just because the tongue is kind of a vascular part of the body, but um, can you grab me some plot? And I'm just going to go for it. So the laser's hot and it cuts, we're going to use instruments instead of our fingers. Um, see how it cuts? Really no bleeding so far. The nice thing about the laser is it does, um, here's a little bit, help cauterize super tiny blood vessels as it cuts. There we go. Not bad. Just a couple little tiny bleeders. <laughs> 
I'm just going to keep a little pressure on for a minute and just see if they stop. There really wasn't much there. But we'll send that out for a biopsy and find out what that is. And hopefully it's nothing cancerous. It's going. It's going great. Um, but she's an old dog, and I think we just really want to get that thing off there and keep her comfortable. All right, so we're all done. Um, there's her tongue now. She's got a little crescent shape out of it. Well, somebody took a little bite out of it, but that cl closed up real nice, and she will be getting her woken up, and she'll be ready to go home shortly. This is Lexi. She's all done. And look how beautiful she looks. <laughs> she just got her IV catheter out and she is ready to go home. We're just getting her medication ready and we're giving her some um, oral medication here before she leaves. And we're going to call her mom and tell her to come and get her. Good girl, Good girl Lex.